dark treasure. Dark treasure. Dark treasure. Play. I think so. Let me make sure I got everything set up before I start playing. Oh no! Sarazzle is live too? Moo. Boo. I want to watch him, but I want to play. But, uh, you know. You know, what can I do? Darn it. Oh darn. When one of your VTuber friends is streaming when you're streaming and you want to watch them, but you want to stream too. Hmm. Hmm. Oh well, this is my time that I always say that I will stream and I missed Monday because I wasn't feeling well and so I am definitely going to stream today and I stream randomly in the week sometimes, but Hmm, I'm liking this turn down the sound because the game is gonna have its own music so I've got to pause chill hot beats even though I like to jam to them all the time do 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 how's my volume I'm sorry, I just try and make sure my volume is okay because I know that I talk kind of softly. Um, so I want to make sure that I can be heard. Hold on, grandma is calling me. Must answer grandma. Hello? Yeah. Wait a minute. Hold on for a second. I forgot what? You forgot to pray while you were here. Oh, I forgot to pray. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I thought you just sing a little text and you can pray a prayer yourself. Yes. You ready to do that? Yes, because I, I happen to be um, live streaming right now, but I paused so that I could talk to you. Oh, thank you so much. All right. Love you. Bye-bye. I mean, you can't ignore the grandma. But I wasn't going to pray with her on live stream. <laughs> you know, grandmas, they, they have their thing. Um... I am happen to be agnostic, you know, that's my thing, but I, I love my family and those that are believers of stuff, I'm, I'm with the, there with them. I'm not going to judge them for it. I don't judge anyone for their beliefs. I've been to plenty of temples and synagogues and churches and different denominations of Christianity. Um, you know, you believe what you believe. And that's all right with me. And if you don't believe in anything, that's still all right with me. Ah, now, sorry about that. Can't let grandma, grandma be ignored, no. So I did go in here to try and turn down um, the music ahead of time so that it doesn't burst my eardrums. Hopefully that's saved. Yes, it did say because it was much louder. Adam Wolf is an intense narrative experience. 
intense. Oh, I forgot to make myself little. Hold on. <laughs> there we go. You can play again, Adam. My name is Adam Wolf. Oh. I'm a detective of the supernatural. He's loud. Two years ago, my sister Allie went missing. I've been looking for her ever since. Each case I solve brings me one step closer to finding her. This is my story. Game is running on low resolution mode. Visual experience may might not be optimal. Why is it running on low resolution mode? Did I tell it to do that? There we go. Aspect correction? Do I want that? Hmm. I don't want it smushy. Okay. Um. His voice was still kind of loud. No more pulling punches. Yeah, you're going into almost into the red here, guy. No more pulling punches. There we go. Just a little bit of yellow. No more pulling punches. This music can go down here. Oh, I love the thunder. I hope I'm in the right spot. I'm a kitty that n never knows if I'm in the right spot or not. But I don't want to be on the bottom because I have a feeling there's going to be lots of words here. And I think everything sounds okay. I'm a big person about sound. Um, I was a DJ once upon a time when I was in the military. Broadcast journalist, DJ, news stories. And so, um, I got a thing about sound. I don't want to um, blow anyone's eardrums. And I actually want to be heard over the music. Uh, I watch a lot of other people on Twitch and sometimes they don't notice that their voice is not above their background noise. Let's see. Let me turn you down just a bit too. Should I turn the music down even more? Let me see what it's hitting. There we go. I'll leave it for now. I'll leave that here. Okay. Difficulty. Um, I'm an easy gal. I'm not even gonna lie. I kinda, I kinda, I kinda be a little special. <laughs> Look, I'm highly medicated. And then I just had a half of a, a brownie edible to relax. <laughs> so, yeah, we're gonna go easy. <laughs> <laughs> this is what you're dealing with this is what you tuned in for i hope you enjoy <laughs> let's play episode oh there's episodes Ooh. okay let's go episode one i'm ready for it i'm ready 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 Ooh, what is that Oh, this is up my alley, cat. Episode one, the ancient flame. For a couple weeks now, the city's been plagued by strange fire breakouts. With stories all over the news. Really? Hmm. Oh, do I need to click something? Well, what's missing from the news <laughs> is that there are people disappearing with each new fire breakout. SFPD is keeping this info under wraps. So are their bodies being burnt to a crisp or they're absolutely disappearing with the fire? An old buddy of mine from the force, Marv, asked me to help him out with this case. Marv, he said, I got, I need help. 
this this case is a little is a little special. I managed to identify one of the perps causing the fires. <laughs> I ended up chasing this pyromaniac through the streets. I run like that. <laughs> I probably run just as bad. I don't run anymore. Bad knees. I chased the killer into a dead end street. He had nowhere to go. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'll snap. Would you like an interactive tutorial? kind of dumb. So do I need the full one? I'm sorry. You turned into uh, I'm a smart cat, but I'm a but I'm a special cat. So let's do the full. Okay. No object the arsonist. Relevant notes and clues will be found stored in your journal, okay? I have to stop the arsonist responsible for the San Francisco fires. Got it. I don't have time for that now. Oh snap. I gotta shoot things. <laughs> this is about to be... What's this? Hint? I don't need a hint yet. There's no need to use my gun here. But you gotta stop the arsonist. Okay. Can I take my gun now? Oh, holy crap. Missed me by the skin of my teeth. No more okay, pulling six punches. Six bullets, but more than enough to stop anything that moves. How do I shoot? What do there I press? There he goes. Look more closely. Examine some areas more closely. Gotcha. Oh, the sewers. Move to another location. Ew. Yuck. Which way did he go? How do I know? This looks more fiery. <laughs> no. Well, I was wrong. A dead end. Okay. I'm always wrong. I'm always wrong when I choose. Yes, I wish I could turn off my sense of smell. I'm, I'm empathy smelling this. Okay, my first thought is to go left, so I'm going to go right. Oh, I'm on fire! Put it out, put it out, put it out! Come on. He went through one of those three tunnels. Well, which one? I was not paying attention. I was trying to put out your fire. Do I need to use a hint? Fine. What's that? What is that? Ooh, I got a weapon. Corroded pipe, sounds good. Items you pick up can be used in various situations. Old metal door, not too sturdy, not too frail either. But why am I going that way? Shouldn't I be following him? I know he didn't go this way. Yes, nothing indicates the killer went here. Yeah. Okay. Okay, how do I go back? Okay. He went up here. He was up here somewhere. Oh, that's up there? The flip? Okay, all of this is showing the same thing. What's this? I got a shawl. This place is a maze. Oh, ladder. Oh, no? Ah. Whoa! 
There he is. The jump. <laughs> I swear, it's not like I'm um, in VR or anything. I'm just staring at my screen, and yeah, this stuff is making me jump a bit. <laughs> I'm excited. Hmm. You wouldn't go where water is. The smell is atrocious. I'm just, I was just making sure there was nothing to pick up up here. Really, a dead end. Fine. Then he went this way. Is something down there? Oh, you wouldn't want to step into that. I have to step into that if I want to move left, don't I? Mother truck and dead end. I guess I can't use any of that stuff. <sighs> I hate closed spaces. Me too. Can I punch him? Oh my gosh. There we go. Get his eyes again. There we go. How many times do I gotta do this? Gun now. There we go. I figured it out. <laughs> As the burning monster fell to the ground, I had this gut feeling I just couldn't shake. This guy was a mere pawn. <sighs> this game is exciting for me. I'm sorry. Maybe because I'm. <laughs> Maybe because I, you know, don't. Unless I'm with my uh, brother cats and and my son cat and we're playing like um what's the magic if we're playing together on playstation or nintendo switch or something like that i don't play by myself that often so playing a game on my computer like this that actually has some excitement and makes me have to you know do things is like so awesome so awesome so awesome pause one moment sorry i apologize apologize one moment give me one moment please give me one moment please thank you thank you and if you are new here I vape I enjoy vaping let me vape <sighs> need my nicotine he was behind the fires, all right. But who was behind him? What the hell? It is not over. Snap. All will burn. Why are you so loud, fire demon? What the hell was that thing? Fire demon. What's that? It's a cot. 
I should call Marv and fill him in. During the course of the game, sometimes you can use the phone to make calls and complete other tasks as well. Really? Marv, my old guy. Adam, what's the status? Wait a minute, Marv looks much better right here. The pictures that they were showing of Marv don't look as good as... Well, I mean, Marv isn't my type, but I'm just saying. I got him. Whatever that guy was, he was no ordinary human. I guessed as much. That's why we called you in on this one. Supernatural is your thing. I'll send a team to your location to set up the scene. Go home, Adam. You did good. Marv, you take terrible pictures. Marv was pleased. Me? Couldn't shake off the feeling that the fat has hit the fire. The fat has hit the fire. There was nothing more I could do that night. It was time to go home. Sleep would bring me little comfort. I knew the nightmare that was waiting for me all too well. Same as every night. I have nightmares too, Adam. But you know, mine are different every night. And they're in color. And a lot of times they have a soundtrack. So they're very, like, movie-ish. Movie-ish. Hmm. And there she was. My sister, Allie. And her disappearance, which keeps haunting me. In my dreams, sister. I'm reaching out to her. She always slips through my fingers. It's always a dead, it's always a dead family member. Something wasn't right. Things were not, were not, were not where I left him last night. I had a visitor while I was asleep. A visitor who left clues. Okay, was I the only one that heard that uh, somewhere, that the little hiccup, that remix? Okay. Click on the eyeball, intense focus. You got a crow up in here? Umbrella? How am I supposed to know what wasn't there before? Door, it's now open, and there's a muddy footprint. Your chair is out of place. This is move, a footprint, a few traces of mud. Oh, somebody was going through your files. Select the question mark to view instructions for the current puzzle. Okay. I have to arrange the clues in a logical order. Well, the first order of business was... Gotcha. Okay. Oh, gosh, there's it's time. So A. That's A. Oh, no. This is A. How do I move it? There we go. There we go. The movement pattern indicates that someone rummaged around my locker. Did they steal anything? I should check it out. Well, yes, you should. Hmm. Nothing seems out of the ordinary here. But I'm sure the thief tampered with this area. I can view from a different angle? Well... My visitor left a package for me. The moment I held it in my hands, I simply knew. This will change everything. They can be manipulated further. A plus or minus symbol indicates that you can inspect it more closely. This is detailed. I'm glad I went for the full how you do it. A watch. Why would someone leave me a watch? Hmm. Time is not set. Is that a... Not an Ouroboros. Um, infinity symbol on it. That's a strange symbol. Or is it an Ouroboros? Is that a snake? I'm blind as a bat and I'm very close to my, my computer and I still can't tell. There's some marks on the paper. Oh, some marks. I guess I don't have what I need yet. Okay. I saw something else lighting up. Do I want to look up here? 
the Necronomicon. Really? Still haven't read it? We'll do so one of those days. One of these days. Ah, pencil. That's what I needed. Fingerprint dusting kit. Nope. A UV lamp? Okay. Alright, I gotta find the UV lamp. Can I just use a pencil on it? Three twenty. On the wrapping paper that came with a watch. <sighs> this can't be a coincidence. Why is it not four twenty? Ah. Uh, that would just be too tongue in cheek, I guess. This isn't just a regular watch. Its abilities will be useful throughout the game. Really now. Well, holy crap. Three. Should I put it at 320 yet? What in the name of... A vision of a chair. A vision of some kind in the shape of my umbrella. Huh. Oh, do I move it? Oh. Holy crap. Intense. I, s I saw. I saw the past. 320. The visitor. He left something on my board. I am loving this game. I am loving this game. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> no, I don't want to be back there. I needed that. For fingerprints. Okay. Let me just make sure before I dust some fingerprints. Where's the board? This board? This board. This board. Allie, my sister. This is where I kept track of her case. All these years and still not any closer to finding her. Do I test anything here? I guess not. That's the last picture of Allie and me. Before she disappeared. Adam, you're not bad looking. I need a VTuber boyfriend. A photo of her apartment. The way I found it after she went missing. What's this? I know this file like the back of my hand, and this wasn't here before. Some Zakat. That name rings a bell. Boom. Boom. Zakat Gallery. First that pyromaniac, now this. This place was definitely worth paying a visit. But, first things first. The visitor had to have left fingerprints on the paper. First things first. I pop a... Oh, sorry. Biggie Smalls just popped into my head. <laughs> okay, nothing else here. Okay. There we go, my apartment. So, the door? I want to run this newspaper clip for fingerprints first, okay. Am I supposed to know how to do this? What if his fingerprints are alien? Gotcha. 
demon. I'll take a photo of it and send it to Marv. He can run it through the database. I was just about to get the camera. Hey, Marv, I got a favor to ask. I just sent you a partial fingerprint. Can you run it through your database? Sure, but it'll take some time. Any suspects we should focus on? Why does Marv look different now? <laughs> nah, I got no idea who I belong to, but just run it against everything you've got. Wait a minute. Now he looks like... Okay, I swear, he, he's, he's been a couple of different races so far. Uh, Marv first looked like a black dude, then he looked like um, he was Hispanic. Now... Okay, I'll send it to forensics and call you I'm when I have something. I'm not so sure. While Marv works his magic, I'm off to investigate this gallery. <laughs> no rest for the wicked. Okay, uh, travel faster than ever using your map application. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so the map, the map, the mother truck and map. What's this? Okay, so we want to go here. What you doing, dude? Why am I moving that around? Why am I doing this? Why the flip am I doing this? Do I talk to him? He looks pretty grim. I'll leave him alone. You look pretty grim, Adam. You can take him. An exhibit of artifacts from the Orient. Well, let's go in. Is that dude gonna bum rush me? Okay, no, I guess not. The gallery gave off a strange vibe. I knew the security room would be the perfect place to look for clues, given all those cameras. See, why does this feel kind of racist, though? Why are you gonna talk to the man wearing the, um, I forgot what it's called. The direct thing for uh, Middle Eastern people. Yeah. Greetings. I am Saeed Al Qadir. Welcome to my exhibition. Okay, it's yours. <laughs> nice to meet you. Name's Adam Wolf. I've heard of you, Mr. Wolf. You dabble in supernatural things. Yes. What brings you here? Give me all your money. I'm investigating the recent oh. conflagrations that yeah. plague San Francisco. We've had several fires here, but. Uh, Many in San Francisco can say the same. I don't see how I can help you. Let me show you Zakat. Do you mind if I had a look around? Not at all, Mr. Wolf, but uh, keep away from the restricted areas. Now, if you'll excuse me, this is a social event after all, and one must mingle. Don't tell me that I can't go into these restricted places. I'm going in the restricted places because you know why? Because I'm Adam Wolf, bitch. Okay, the security room probably has some surveillance footage. I'd love to take a peek, but I don't want to risk them. Adam. Adam. What am I going to do? Push these people out the way? Excuse me. Excuse me. Back up. Get out the way. Sister? Why do you look like my sister? Touch me again and you lose the hand. Oh, holy crap. Sorry. I just need to take a look at the information display. Huh. Well, I mean, you were pushing people out of the way, so... Holy shit, why is that in such bright colors? Okay, the Dagger of Ar-Rahad is mentioned in many legends, but its exact origin remains shrouded in mystery to this day. Okay, next. Nothing else? Okay, fine. That was it? I pushed all those people out the way for that? Is there more? Give me more. Get you then. Okay. The top, This top of the line TV is in stark contrast with the ancient items on display. Yeah, it is. What else is here? Wait a minute, what's that? Various art pieces and artifacts, mostly quite exotic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The dagger is the centerpiece of the exhibition. Mm. Okay, is that all I'm gonna do here? I'm not breaking into the security room? Are we for real right now? Open GPS application. 
yeah, it's up to me. So that's what I got to do. What am I going to do next? Wait a minute. Do I have someplace new up here? The entrance and the exhibit. Okay. My apartment. I feel like I'm not done in there. What was this for? A water bottle. What am I going to do with this water bottle? Oh, am I going to look for prints? No? Okay. Forget you. Look for prints here? No? Why do I have a scalpel? Who? <laughs> hey, it's always good to carry a knife. But what, what am I, who am I about to chop up? There's nothing else to do here. Yeah. Mother trucker. Oh, I am blind. What is that? What is that? Where does it go? I can't take it. I'm going to put it there. No, I'm put it there. No, am I going to chop it? No, I'm gonna... I don't even know what the heck this is. What is this? Why did it make me grow? Oh, wait a minute. Hmm, what do I do here? Um, you gotta fix the broken link. I'm stupid. That goes there. But, um, how do I fix the broken link? I see no way to do that. I don't see some extra... I did... I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. So I'm gonna put this right here. I got it now. I'm fixing stuff. Okay. Got it. Oh, I forgot to read that. Can I go back? Dag nab it. Okay, some testimonies um, claim it can grant eternal life. Others shun the item, believing it to be cursed. For every grain of truth, there is a mound of superstition. Okay. Oh, it's missing one. Let's put that here. And what else is missing? Do you go right there? I guess so. I don't even know. Oh, does it go down here? No? What is it? Oh, okay. Oh, it's the piece of the sword. Okay. Today, the dagger is in custody of, Al of the Al Qadar family. You're missing a the. Um, and is sometimes exhibited in museums and galleries all around the world. That doesn't go right there? You sure about that? Does this go on you? That goes right there. Oh. Okay. I get a present too. Why, yes, I do. Souvenir. Can I look at it? Wait a minute. Then what's on display? It looks just like the real thing. You sure that's a replica? Start presentation. No, I don't need to start presentation. Oh. 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 <laughs> so many priceless items in the gallery, yet they have the cheapest lock system for their security room. 
Um, am I using this? No. That and this won't work. Um, what do I need? Oh, I need a pass. I see. From the security guard? Okay, well, we can do it that way. Sure. This was sure to give me a view of the entire gallery, but the guard would have surely found me and kicked me out. I needed to find a way to stay the night. With this many cameras, there's got to be some suspicious activity caught on tape. Yes, but let me look in the tape. Shouldn't a, secure, shouldn't a guard keep this with himself? Yes. What did I just pick up? A screwdriver. Okay. There's no disc. Okay. I already looked at you. Nothing else? It's tight. It's slightly open but stuck. Well, I got a screwdriver. <laughs> What's in that book? Oh, the security journal. Locked. Can I use this? <laughs> then give me some lock picks. <laughs> what the? Okay. The burning. That goes together. Okay. Let me get... You don't go right there? There we go. You know, I just realized it gave me cheat, some cheat uh, coloring. I wasn't even paying att attention to the to the cheat help. Uh, da, da, da. Hmm. The burning exhibitionist on the loose. Hmm. This confirms that something strange is happening at this gallery. Yes, yes it does. And what do we have here? I have a 24 hour shift today, but I don't want to spend the night in here. Something strange is going on. I'd rather be at home with my family. 2814, remember it already. 2814, remember it already. Two, eight, one, four, remember it already. No, I don't need that. What's in here? Oh, a disc. Camera. Why was that in the trash? Two, eight, one, four. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay, where are we? Okay, so this is at the front. Huh. So this all happened right as it turned midnight. There's some sort of connection here. The fires. They all happen at midnight. I, I said that, didn't I? I still can't get in that. Okay. What else is in here? 
look at my where's my journal okay should I call no why did I do that map I still have nowhere else to go what am I th oh so I shouldn't look at midnight why not isn't that what the watch is for my magical magical girl watch Okay, I'm leaving. Just making sure. Wait. One moment. Just making sure nothing said anything dinner. Different. <laughs> dinner. Let's make sure nothing said dinner. I need to spend the night at the gallery. It's a matter of life and death. Really? You're just gonna come out with it like that? Sir, I don't know who you are, so please, move along. Show your badge. I'm the detective investigating the recent conflagrations. This place seems to be connected to them somehow. Don't know about any connections, but we did have a couple of fires here. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, you sure did. But if I'm to let you spend the night, I'll need to see a badge first. Yeah, why... Don't you have... You don't have a badge? Can I get one from... I guess I can't. I, I was gonna try and call... Um, what's the name? Okay. Where am I going? My apartment? I guess so. Where's my badge? Is it in the box? Oh, I have this. Box cutter. Even though they call it a scalpel. Which is... Do I have a badge in there? Nope. Oh, hidden object puzzle. <laughs> There's Allie's business card. I remember how my old cell phone still in working condition. This thing is indestructible. A metronome. Musician's best friend. Helps me it? stay on beat. Allie made this straw man statuette when we were kids. I still keep it with me. What straw man statuette? Oh, there it is. This photo of Allie is a few years old. She disappeared shortly after this was taken. Oh, where's the photo? Oh. This veil is a memento from my first case as a detective of the supernatural. Haunted house stuff. <laughs> Never gets old. Veil? Veil. Oh, it's okay. Gold Medal of Valor. It was the high point of my police career. I'm not seeing a medal. Where's your medal? And why was a box of pizza in that box that you said has been sitting for seven months, you nasty... Okay, um, looking for a medal. <laughs> That's not it. I didn't think it was. What is it? Where is it? Getting closer. Let me see. Is that it? This looking glass was a present from Marv when I was made detective. I gave up smoking years ago, but I still keep this lighter. Light. Wow, it's been ages since I played any games. This one was a blast. Oh, well, my comic book collection used to be huge, but most of it was sold to pay the bills. Hey, my old police badge. This actually might still open some doors. That's what we're looking for. Do I need to look at this? Do I have anything new to put here? Am I supposed to put anything up here? No, I don't think so. Let me make sure. What does this say? My guitar. Playing it helps me relax. If I could play an instrument, it would help me relax. That's my pet raven, Hubris. Mm. Mm. Mm.
Okay. Take the keys to my office desk. There's a spare uniform there. I get a spare uniform? Oh, because I'm undercover. Staying the night. Wait a minute. It's supposed to be in this drawer? This little drawer? The uniform? Well, the only thing left to do is wait for midnight. <laughs> I'm enjoying this so far. Are you enjoying? You fell asleep? You took a nap? And when you took a nap? This happened. Um, you're not in the uniform. There's a fire in the gallery. You think? I have to get out. Um, first, let's use that. Or is there anything else I should do? It's gonna be hot. No? This. I have to put out that fire as soon as possible. You think? Okay, I still need to get out of here though. What's that? That's quite special. Oh, that was close. Um, okay. I do. Oh, that, that's what I do. <laughs> what can I do now? It's time to. Oh, escape? Why aren't you letting me escape then? Oh, out here. I knew that. Oh, crap. There's no going back now. I'll have to jump. This looks safer. Oh, my God. Here goes nothing! The landing was harder than expected. I could barely breathe. But I managed to get myself out of the dumpster. Yay! <laughs> out of the shadows, Said approached. His words rang in my head. Mr. Wolf, you have no idea what you got yourself into. I hope you will survive the experience. Huh? Are you threatening me? After that, I just let go. And the world was swallowed by darkness. Really? Out of a trash can and then just out on the street. And you think that's safe? See, now you got trapped by some shady people. I awoke in a strange room. Saeed was there. Together with three... Associates. That demon almost got me, but... I had the feeling I wasn't out of the fire just yet. Out of the frying pan, into the fire. He's seen too much. He should be eliminated. 
Holy crap, lady. Way to be vindictive and bloodthirsty. Do you know who this is? He is Adam Wolf, the detective of the supernatural. He can help us with our problem. I don't like it. I don't like you. You hardly like anybody, Fang. Mr. Wolf, please, excuse our lack of courtesy. We could use your help. Why don't we just start from the beginning, Mr. My name is Antoine de la Croix. These like are my name. associates. We are in grave danger, Mr. Wolf. Because you were doing something shady. You know it. You were doing something shady. You unleashed hell on earth or something. But as you said, let's start at the beginning. Our story dates quite a while back, Mr. Wolf. My friends and I first met a long time ago. We were five warriors, five adventurers, seeking eternal life. Let's see, here we go. You were doing shady stuff. Our paths led us to each other, and we all found ourselves at the resting place of Kanjar, the dagger of eternal life. What am I going to do with this? I don't even know what I'm holding. Oh. Lever. That's a big ass lever. The dagger would bestow its owner the gift of eternal life. Wait, that's not the dagger. We decided to form a union, a pact of blood, and become its owners. That's All the, of us. That's, that's just a knife from the corner store. What... Why? Hmm. I gotta cut everybody? Why are you bleeding black? All was well until one of us, Joseph Whitman, died. It broke the pact we made, and the consequences were dire. Hmm. So, you did something shady. And what happens was that it... A demonic entity was, was released from mm -hmm. the dagger, determined to castigate this breaking of the pact. Since one of us died... We now all have to die. That and Mr. Wolf, sense. we don't want to. Yes. Well, how long have you been alive is the question. See, I have a feeling that you guys have been alive for a very long time. Um, and you tried to get this eternal life thing, didn't read the fine print, was messing with things you shouldn't, and now you're scared. Punks. I can understand the sentiment. Quite. Whitman was a scholar and spent days on end researching our pact and the dagger. His interest seemed obsessive at times. Maybe he was trying to save your lives, you dummy. How about that? Maybe after, you know, he realized that, oh, let's just, you know, take this ancient knife and cut ourselves and give it blood and then make this pact. Maybe that's not a good idea without knowing all the facts. I'm just saying. His home might contain some clues as to how the demon can be dealt with. You can find Whitman's address in the lobby. Okay. Do I have... I didn't care much for Whitman or his evergreen buddies. But if that demon wasn't stopped, the entire city would burn to the ground. I took the case. True. It's about the people. Wait a minute. Let me go back there. Let me make sure this didn't say anything. So that's the guy that died. <laughs> I think the fat guy's name was Crumb. That's Delacroix. He seemed less creepy than the others. Her name's Fang. I don't think she liked me very much. You think? And that's Saeed al Qadar, the owner of the gallery. I have no idea who this man is. Isn't that the guy that died? Or is this the guy that died? I think it was this guy, but okay. 
It's a good thing I went back and looked. Nothing outside, right? Fountain gardens. They are living the good life. Yeah, duh. Nothing else here, right? Gotta be careful. Gots to... Gots to be careful. Make sure I don't miss anything. Oh, wait a minute. I was supposed to get his address. Where was it? Okay, you're not going back in there, but... Where's the address? So that's crumb. That's who? Oh, they're in the wrong spot. I got it now. It takes me a moment, but I get it. It just takes me a moment. I'm a little slow on the uptake. Okay. The names do not correspond. Yes, um, I noticed that. Delacro. So we thought this guy was Crumb. Fang is right. There we go. It's the address of a late member of this group of collectors or whatever they are. They're immortals. They're immortals that dabbled in the supernatural and are about ready to die. Whitman's estate. A uh, flip? Yeah, what was he doing here? Perhaps it helped hide whatever was going on in the house? Okay. Okay. 